Hi, this is uh, Tutor Nick P, and this is noun phrase 215. The noun phrase today is a bum rap. You know, somebody could get a bum rap. Okay, let's take a look at the board here. If somebody wants a screenshot. Okay, let's get right to it. Uh, if someone receives a bum rap, he or she has been falsely accused of something. Basically, it is something that is unjust especially if it led or could lead to imprisonment, you know, the person actually going to jail. Uh, it could also be used to mean one is unfairly portrayed in a way that hurts one's reputation. So you can get a bum rap that way too, that, you know, it damages your reputation. All right, let's continue. Rap in the early 1900s referred to someone being arrested and sentenced uh, basically being a lawbreaker. At that time, the word bum also had the meaning of false, not correct, untrue, or unfair. Okay, let's continue. For example, we still say a bum deal. Somebody got a bum deal, you know, a bad deal, an unfair deal. Yeah, somebody got a bum deal. Today, in movies, we still hear someone say that a criminal or suspect may have a rap sheet, yeah, especially in police shows like CSI or something like that. It's the, the suspect there. They see if he has a rap sheet, see if he's been arrested a number of times before, uh, meaning someone's record of all the times one has been arrested. That would be a rap sheet. Okay, so you're also seeing where this comes from, too, at the same time. The origin may have come from a quote printed in the New York Telegraph in 1907. Here is the quote. Then uh, another fellow, remember fellow sometimes means man, told of how poor old Patty, you know, Patty's the name here. Uh, I think it's another form of Pat or Patrick, Patty. Uh, Leon got sent away on a bum rap. Sent away means probably was sent to jail on a bum rap. Since that time, bum, bum uh, has come to mean a false accusation. So bum could mean that somebody's falsely accused of something. All right, and we have uh, three examples to show just how we would use this. Uh, that convict went to jail for 10 years on a bum rap. After DNA technology, he was eventually proven to be innocent. Yeah, a lot of people were. Uh, we didn't really start to see the DNA technology come out until like the mid 1990s. Uh, and a lot of people that were falsely accused, you know, if they could, you know, dig it up and have a DNA test, sometimes they could prove that they weren't actually the one that committed the crime. So again, if you're falsely accused, then you actually got convicted, you went to jail. Clearly you got a bum rap. All right, number two. He claimed he got a bum rap because he was framed. Well, if somebody frames you in the movies, we see sometimes somebody will frame someone maybe to hide their own crime, or maybe they just want somebody else to suffer, so they, they, they frame them for some reason. Uh, number three here, they gave me a bad rap. I never did what they accused me of. So in this case, maybe it's more about reputation again. Okay, anyway, uh, I hope you got it. I hope it's clear. I hope it's very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.